My name's uh, Lance Corporal Gaz Lovett. I'm in Afghanistan. I'm uh, an aviation crewman on the Lynx Mark 9 Alpha. It's commonly known as being a dog runner. Typical day in Afghanistan. We, uh, I'll get up, come down here. We'll have a brief about what we're doing for the day, who's doing what, what aircraft's doing what. Come down as a crew, get it sorted out, get his kit on the aircraft, good to go, and we'll go flying. Uh, walk around, I'm checking for any uh, flaps or caps that may have been left open, or if there's anything uh, leaking, or if there's any issues with any of the airframe that I can see. Previous links was carrying the uh, GPMG 7.62mm machine gun. We can still carry that, and we do, but we've also, with the upgraded engines on this aircraft, we can carry the M3 M50 cal, which gives us a great range. Once you fit the weapon to the aircraft, you then carry out normal safety precautions, which is just a general check that you do on every weapon system to make sure that it's fully functional. To become an aviation recruitment in the Army Air Corps, first of all, you've got to be in the Air Corps, uh, be an air trooper, which is what you start out as. And then once you're a class one air trooper, whether that's signals or ground crew, you can then apply to be uh, an aviation crewman. When we're in the air, my responsibilities are to look out for any other aircraft that could cause a danger to our aircraft, also looking for uh, insurgent activity for other aircraft going in and out of PVs. Being in Afghanistan, we get a lot of chance to use the ranges out here, which are better than in the UK. This is a full 360 range, it gives us greater, more time on target. Firing a weapon on a range is awesome. Firing from a helicopter full stop is awesome, whether that's GPMG or 50 cal. A long day out here can be very demanding with all your kit on but it's nothing compared to what the guys on the ground have got and it gives you an awesome sense of self-achievement when you're picking them up out of the PVs and bringing them back here.